Super Mario Run. Without a doubt, this is one of the most important mobile games to come out in a long time. Mario's long-awaited debut on the mobile phone has been long overdue, and I am pleased to say that, despite a few kinks and bugs, Super Mario Run really holds up, and has set the stage for lots of great upgrades to come. Super Mario Run is a charming endless runner developed by Nintendo for iOS. In it, you play the titular Italian plumber as you run, hop, and spin your way through a number of well-designed levels and take your skills to PvP mode as you challenge others to a battle of the busted bricks. In the single-player mode, you have six worlds with four levels each, and though these levels can be finished in a fairly quick succession, the opportunity to retrieve three different levels of multicolored coins does add a challenging level of replay value. As for PvP mode, you can challenge players all over the world to run through looped versions of those same levels. From collecting coins and showing off flashy moves for the toads who are watching, you tally a final score that determines who goes home the winner. The city building aspect of Super Mario Run is also a big factor here. Those toads you won in the PvP mode can be used to unlock buildings, decorations, and even other runners like Luigi and Yoshi. It is true that the city building of SMR is light, really light, in fact. Beyond the occasional bonus tickets or coins that you receive daily, I didn't find a lot of reasons to come back. Actually, the game as a whole is light. The levels go by fast, and the PvP becomes sort of samey after a couple of days of light play. And that can be a lot to ask of a game that comes with a $10 price tag for the full experience. Regardless, I find myself holding out hope for Super Mario Run. Sure, the city builder is light, the levels are light, and the PvP is light, but what it does contain is an excellent foundation to build a bigger game on as time goes by. Additional content that I'm sure Nintendo is working on as we speak will keep this one alive for a long, long time. Oh. Oh. Oh, uh, just give me a, a second here. Okay, okay, uh, let's, um, <clears throat> let's start again. Super Mario Run is $10, and it is not worth it. Real talk? I was excited about this game for about a weekend. A weekend of some casual gameplay was really all it took for me to finally ask myself, is this seriously it? It's not a bad game. It's simple, colorful, and the music is nice. It feels decent enough to play. The classic sound effects take me back to a place in my childhood that my nostalgic brain goggles will simply not let me shake, and that sort of thing gives me happiness on the level of the opening notes of the Star Wars theme. But that isn't content. That's you remembering how much you love something from your childhood. And Super Mario Run isn't really worthy of that. It's a shame, because, like I said before, if this were the foundation of something bigger, I could really get behind it, challenge myself with different modes, and get pumped about the next big set of downloadable levels and updates to the city building mode, and perhaps if SMR was solely an endless runner, or solely a city builder, there would have been more blood to squeeze from this stone. But instead, Nintendo settled for releasing a mediocre endless runner alongside a mediocre city builder. And that's not going to cut it. Because we expect better from Nintendo. But sadly, if they don't shift their focus onto the innovation and fun that got them their status in the gaming world in the first place, that will no longer be the case. We won't expect better from Nintendo. And at that point, at least we won't be quite as disappointed release after release. But it sucks, because games like Reigns have proven that there's plenty of room for innovation in the mobile market. It just seems that that innovation won't be coming from Nintendo. Hey, Daddy, don't sink a little drinky. Daddy, get sad and blue. Sneak a little drinky, snickety do. Sneak a little drinky past you. Sneak a little drinky, snickety do. Sneak
Thank you. Thank you.